Hi everyone and welcome to this video and if you're new welcome to my channel. Today we are going to discuss a mascara, a new mascara that I tried. I think it's not a new mascara out there but it's new for me and I do look tired. I had this makeup for over 14-15 hours but I'm back because I did try this mascara today this morning for the first time when I was applying my makeup and went to work and I was outside uh, for a couple of hours and it was raining and very windy I think I look like a mess right now but if you want to see what mascara I'm talking about please keep on watching yeah yesterday at my work one of my friends she had those beautiful long eyelashes and I asked her what kind of mascara she wears and she told me she wears this L'Oreal mega volume Miss Manga mascara I never heard about this mascara before I don't remember seeing it anywhere I don't remember seeing it in the store but I don't all reach for L'Oreal mascara except the one that I'm using right now and that was something that YouTube made me buy those paradise uh, something I can't really remember the name of it and uh, I really liked her lashes so I went yesterday and bought one for myself and it's what I have on my eyelashes today now I want to say I did apply only one coat uh, because I got those beautiful very nice eyes now I had this makeup for 14-15 hours and I can see that it did transfer a little bit under my eyes but it not, it's not very bad um, I'm going to zoom you in so you can see better I don't know if you can see but it did transfer a little bit down here and I didn't touch uh, my under eye area at all today because I really wanted to see how this uh, mascara will wear now I have been outside for maybe 2-3 hours and it was very windy and it was raining and it was very bad weather so I really can I can say that it hold up pretty good now my eyelashes are nice I ha still have mascara on my eyes and it looks nice now if I remove this under my eyes it removes very easily so I can just go so I can just do this at my work and it will be gone now I really want to apply this mascara right now maybe the second or third coat just to see how it's going to look on my eyes applying a couple of coats now that's what I usually do I just put one coat today because I was in hurry the brush looks like this I don't know if you can see it but it's a strange brush it looks strange for me I never used this kind of brush before and it's flexible as you can see it is flexible so that's very good um, I thought it would be clumpy the mascara it looks like that but it really didn't apply like that on my eye eyelashes and uh, I don't know it looks like a Christmas tree <laughs> actually let's just apply it felt a little bit strange when I was applying this mascara for the first time but look now it looks a little bit clumpy but it looks very clumpy applying two coats right now but it doesn't look bad And I really like this brush for my low lash line. As you can see, it, there are a little bit clumps on the lashes, but it's not bad. It, I kind of like it. So this is how it looks the second coat and I don't think I need third coat right now and I think it looks nice it really opened my eyes a little bit they, it did make my eyelashes a little bit longer not too long so but 
my eyelashes are thicker and it looks uh, nice I do like it I really do like it and I'm surprised that it didn't transfer more like some other mascaras now let me read on the website what it says uh, Miss Manga uh, features a 360 degree flexible brush for effortless application its unique brush has a flat surface intensify and um, amplify upper lashes while it uh, conical shape contour the lower lash line so this formula uh, also is supposed to ultimate volume and hold now it does hold volume I, yeah why not really like this mascara if you haven't tried it try it because it's not a bad mascara and if you know me and watch my videos you know how picky I am with mascaras that's something that I always try and always looking for a very good mascara that won't transfer on my lower lash line or under my eyes because I hate that and this did do that after 15 hours 14 15 hours but it didn't look bad and I did clean it up very fast just with my using my fingers and sometimes I can feel that when I do have mascara and I want to clean it under uh, clean it up with my fingers because I don't have time to do take anything else it's almost impossible for me sometimes to remove some a couple of mascaras but this one was very easy to remove and it looks very nice now I did only use this once but I did like it so I know I also have another mascara that I bought from Rebecca Stella that didn't do so much for my eyelashes and I didn't like it first time I didn't like the second time and I didn't like it the third time either I do use it but I use it when I'm home and not going anywhere. It doesn't transfer, it just doesn't do anything for my lashes. So I really like this mascara and I think the pack packaging is beautiful. I kind of like this metallic rose color. I love metallic sh shades. I think that looks beautiful. And on the, on the other side it says mega volume from top to bottom lashes. And this is in black so yeah mega volume miss manga from l'oreal it's a good mascara if you have a favorite mascara and you want me to try it please tell me down below I and I will check it out thank you so much for watching give a thumbs up if you like this video and see you in my next video bye